there, it's Rachel from the Hot Chocolate Styled Stock Library. In this tutorial video, I'm going to show you my one quick tip for making any styled stock photo work for your brand. So let's head on over to Canva and select social media graphic. So one question that I most often get is how do I actually make a stock photo work for my brand if it's not in my brand color? And this is a pretty easy fix, believe it or not. There's a couple things that you can do in order to make virtually any stock photo really work for you. So I'm going to go over to my uploads and select the photo that I want to use. Let's say I'm going to use this one from our new winter pink and gray collection. So I'll click and drag it out so that it fits my entire canvas. Now let's say that these colors, while pretty, are not necessarily my brand colors. Let's say for example that my brand colors are turquoise and gold. So how am I going to make this stock photo work for me? The easiest way to do that is to add an overlay. So what I want you to do is click on elements, shapes, and then choose this square shape here. Now click it and drag it out so that it covers the entire image. Come over to your color selector and choose your brand color. Now if you have Canva for work, it's probably already in here in your palette. If not, you can click on the plus and then you can add in your color code. So your hex code, if you already have it for your specific brand color. And just because I'm showing you this as an example, I am going to say, pretend that this is my brand color. So what I'll do now, once I've selected my brand color as the overlay, I'm gonna to go to transparency and I'm gonna bring the transparency down a little bit so that I can see some of the photos still peeking through. It's going to add interest to my graphic rather than using just a plain turquoise background. But I'm not worried about what color is under there because now it's going to work specifically for my brand. So if my colors are turquoise and gold, I can go ahead and add any elements that are part of my branding graphics. For example, we have got this really cute well, I've got quite a few gold options for you from our Styled Stock Library graphics packs, but let's say I was creating a quote image. I could use these cute little gold quotation marks and add them in here. And then I could write out a quote. So I'll hit T for text, and then I will type out my quote. Okay, so let's just say this is my quote. Then I can go ahead and change my color change my font, play around with my text and line spacing, make it a little bit larger if I need to. Just adjust however I need to. Add in who said the quote and then I can adjust by selecting all the layers in order to do that click on one and hold down shift and then you can actually just grab them all and you'll be able to center it better and then oh of course if you wanted to add your URL you could do that as well Okay, so some really quick edits there, but just to show you how easy it is to create a graphic that is going to work with your brand colors. All right, so there we go. By adding the overlay, I have incorporated my brand colors. I said it, my colors were turquoise and gold, so I've actually incorporated this pretty little gold element as well to tie in both of my brand colors. You would just use your specific brand fonts add your URL, and then all of a sudden you've taken a stock photo and turned it into a graphic that's going to be customized and unique to you.